Hello, I'm Sarah Ganella. I'm a third grade teacher at Runnymede Elementary School. Today we're going to be looking at expressing whole numbers as fractions using models and number lines. Let's start with expressing the whole number 1. Let's take our rectangle and divide it into thirds. If we want to show this whole rectangle shaded in, Children would recognize that there are three parts shaded and three parts in our rectangle. Three thirds of our rectangle is shaded in. One whole rectangle is shaded in. Now, this can also be shown using the number line. If we take our number line, we have our zero. We have one third, two thirds, and three thirds, which is equal to one whole. Now, we may need to represent a whole number, let's say three. If we want to represent the whole number three, we're going to need three whole rectangles. Okay, three whole rectangles. If we shade in three whole rectangles, each whole rectangle has one part. The rectangle has one part. It's not divided into any other parts. So we have one whole part. So to represent three whole rectangles as a fraction, we have three whole rectangles shaded. Each rectangle has one part. We would show it like this. If we wanted to show it on a number line, we could take our number line. We'd have zero. Two, three rectangles, and we could show the fractions. This would be one over one, two over one, three over one. So this is how we can take our models and show it on the number line. So these are two different ways of showing whole numbers using models and number lines. 